Hello there, Dick Benedict here. We're playing Heavenly Sword on Hell difficulty, and this is my guide and walkthrough for the aforementioned title and difficulty. We're currently on 4-2. It is entitled On Silent Wings. Um, it's a literary sound sounding title to my ear. I think what I'm thinking about is On Golden Pond. Uh, I've never read it but it just kind of sounds like it but okay so from the last level we have more of these guys and there is a big time failure to um, to do the quick time event too narrow of a window to do it and I'm just I'm getting my ass whooped there's just no denying it um, but remember the last chapter we had um, we had heavies and we also had uh, the female assassins well we have more of the latter over here and then once you've killed uh, a majority of them, did we get that one? Finally. There we go. Um, I really like an enemy that counters your your counter. I, I like it. It's it's really interesting. Um, now if if every enemy in the game did that, then you know, I wouldn't I wouldn't like that at all. But since it's just one enemy that does that, um, it's it's interesting, but it's it's just there's n not enough time. Um, and I often cite God of War 1 as not having, uh, not giving the player enough time to do the quick time events. Um, and that's not that fair because generally speaking, they do give you enough time. It's, um, it's just certain enemies that don't give you enough time and, 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 and excessive tapping of the button, like with those, uh, with the satyrs or the satyrs per depending on how you prefer to pronounce that word. Um, ferociously needing to, to pound on the controller t to complete the circle tapping quick time event, that's just, it's not, not well designed. And then there's one enemy in the game that, um, I don't know its name because there's no bestiary, but it's like one of the cyclops that, um, that does that dash at you and it's, like a berserker type cyclops um, and then when you bring it to the O button there's three quick time events and they don't give you near enough time to do it I think most people who play the game would acknowledge that fact you just don't get that long to press the button um, same goes with these assassins you know I just I find it uh, difficult to, to parry, um, yes, throwing knives at those heavies does some damage, but you're not going to knock them over, so you're really going to have to heft courses and throw them. Um, I think that's a little bit overpowered, actually, throwing courses. The only downside about it is she doesn't really move around too quickly when she's hefting a course. And I, I look at this one, two, three. Like how? How could you not do that if you knew about doing that? Like, a difficult enemy that just can get knocked over like a bowling ball. <laughs> or, not a bowling ball. Like a bowling pin, I should say. So, if you're having trouble with those enemies, that's a great way to kill them. And then we've got this stupidity. So, you need to tap the X button until this is all the way up. Uh, get a shield from the, the bin, toss it, and then you've got to direct it over to the gong. And then once you've hit it, the gate will open, and then you will be done with the chapter. How did we do? Oh, we got three. Good going, Bic. Take care, guys.